It's time to be heard, Birmingham. This great city is home to over one million people, nearly half of which are under 30. We have one of the youngest populations in Europe, a cultural melting pot from across the world speaking over a hundred different languages, something that runs deep into our history. We are a fusion of different traditions, religions and views. With this comes the most amazing and diverse food. The Birmingham food scene booming and buzzing and it feels like a very young city and that's down to the public wanting more of it and getting into it and finding out more about food. We specify using all British products, elderflowers, cherries, nuts, all from the Midlands. Everyone in Birmingham loves a curry. They love spice in this city, so we haven't had to hold back on our spice. So we just thought it was a good home for us to start our business. Every culture adding their unique tastes, passion and produce. Everything was an extension of my heart from my childhood. It was all about invoking those memories I have of shacks in the Indian subcontinent and trying to give people that little experience in the middle of Birmingham. The produce you get in Birmingham is so diverse. There's a range of fish, meat, poultry. You get everything in this market, everything and anything. Going to the market and walking around, seeing all the different produce which are coming in and out of season, you kind of like choose your menu by, by looking at things and smelling. Fresh produce is really important, using lots of raw ingredients because it's a lot healthier for you. We can't keep producing more waste, so it's, we've got to reuse what we can and to change our behavioural habits as well. From Balti to noodles, an award-winning street food to world-class fine dining, Birmingham has it all. We now cook 95% of the food fresh on site. In our kitchens we've also got incredible chefs who can come up with a recipe for a child who perhaps has a very specialist diet. We are truly a global city, but there are also many challenges with our food system and much to be done before everyone in the city has access to a healthy and affordable diet. For some, the cost of fresh food is out of line with income and benefits, and we are often surrounded by adverts and marketing for less healthy food options, which means our children aren't eating enough fruit and vegetables, something that is vital to healthy growth. A lot of people, even if they work, are very short of money. We do get some people who are homeless, we get some people who may have mental health needs. They're facing the challenges that lots of people are facing. Diet-related diseases are on the increase and working families struggle daily with the cost of living, which means more people depend on food banks to get by. We hear from a lot of our charities that the demand for their services are rising and we are continually taking on more members here so that they can access that surplus food. So what I'd love to see is a city where it's much easier and much more available to make healthy choices and you shouldn't have to fight to get food that's healthy and good for your body. That should be absolutely just the natural thing that we're all doing every day. So really bringing all of that together that we have a, a better story about food as a city and we understand how we feed ourselves and where food comes from. We need to rapidly change our food system to create a food environment in our city that works for everyone. From Harborn to Sparkbrook, no matter your background or culture, we want to hear voices from across the city and gather your stories to understand what food means to you. We can only solve these issues by working together and listening to all. So be heard and help us make Birmingham one of the world's greatest cities for food, health and happiness.